Come to an end? Is that freeloader, huh? I know you're napping around here somewhere. On your feet and back to work already, yeah? Ugh, finally. Come on, sunshine. Up and at him. Get up already! <sighs> mm, sorry, what's going on? What's going on? <sighs> Did your head spring a leak while you were napping? Better see if you can even remember your name. Well, looks like there's hope for you yet. Apologies, friend. I'm all right. Is the battle at hand? Of course it is. Why else would I be standing here? You heard who we're up against, yeah? Geralt's mercenaries. Gonna be one hell of a fight, if true. Especially if the Ashen Demon is here. Don't like a smidge of what I've heard about that fella. Or was it a woman? Leave it to you to fumble the details. Did you even catch this Ashen Demon's name? Of course I did. It was... By the goddess, it's right on the tip of my tongue. Yeah, that's it. Demon or no demon, our job is to fight and win. You sound just like the captain. I know they paid up front, but come on. Well, at least one of you has some courage. You've certainly come a long way since I plucked you from that mountain village. But this battle is about more than just victory. Gerald's team has a sterling reputation. Rumor has it they've never blundered even a single job. But once we put them to rout, We'll finally be the greatest mercenaries in all of Leicester. Enemy activity detected, Captain. Looks like we'll be fighting by moonlight. Mind you don't kill each other in the dark. Wasn't expecting a fight so soon, but I guess there's nothing for it. You ready? Ready as I'll ever be. Good luck. And double to you. down to business. We're up against Gerald's mercenaries. Let's move out. 
Drive them straight into their graves! Time to see what you're made of. tougher than this. Hey, you! Clear out that group over there! over this way, yeah? You get the one over there. Can't wait to wrap this up so we can all drown ourselves in ale. complete. The captain ran off ahead of us. Is she gonna be okay? Master your fear and advance! Keep your eyes open. We still don't know if the Ashen Demon is here. Here. We're saved! Now 
Push! Push the enemy back! About time a foe with some teeth showed up. But they still don't stand a chance against Burling's mercenaries. <laughs> Now, isn't this a sight? You must be the infamous Ashen Demon. I can't wait to tear you apart. This will be the end of the Ashen Demon. No one can beat the Captain. What? Captain? Oh. They took out Wesley like she was nothing. I can't believe I'm losing to some damn kid. Darling's in trouble. I have to reach her before it's too late. There's so many of them. Only one thing to do about that. When my dream was finally in sight. You monster. The captain's dead. What are we gonna do now? Stand down or die. We're gonna stand. We're gonna fight. And we're gonna avenge the captain. Why am I so scared? It's just one merc. Run! Run while you can! with you huh? the cycle of this world I will not allow it to perish with you Where did you get that power? Witness no idea. It's just what I need to bring you down. <laughs> person.
did what we came to do. Everyone, fall back! What? Sorry, but this fight is over. Hey, wait! Why? We've achieved our goal. Your job was to stop us, and you failed. <sighs> Another time, perhaps. Hey, we're not done here! Why, why am I so tired? You're awake. Not sure I would have been able to sleep at night with your <laughs> blood on my hands. Am I dead? No, not yet. And you're not a good listener either. Did I not just say how pleased I am that you're still alive? Regardless, I'm a being who exists on the edge of dreams and reality. You are all, huh? But for now, let me speak plain. You are slated to die. Right now, I'm the only thing holding your meager life together. And to be blunt, it's beginning to tire me. Um, thank you? Oh, oh, my. That's the first time anyone has ever shown me gratitude. And I must say, I like it very much. Hear me well. You are a crucial piece of this world's cyclical... Yeah, uh, no, this will never do. You're far too groggy to absorb what I'm saying. For now, I needn't tell you how you'll get back on your feet. I need only convince you that you will. I don't understand. I'm already up and about. Ah. Perhaps here you are, but not in reality, where it counts. <laughs> your cluelessness is actually quite charming. I think you're starting to grow on me. Still, the important thing is what you do after you wake. And what should that be? Recall, please, how the Ashen Demon bested you. Came within an inch of snuffing out your life. If you attempt the fight again the same way, you will reach the same conclusion. This would force me to step in once more, which would be most annoying and also rather counterproductive, if I'm honest. You don't need to worry. I won't lose next time. Although, who's to say when that time will come? Who indeed? My captain and comrades are dead. The company is finished. So there's only one thing I can do. Start over. Huh. I thought you'd be more sentimental. Did they not take you in? Care for you? Gold's the only thing that ever held us together. And death is something we're all too used to. I never knew my real parents, and I lost the mother who raised me. Parting's just come easy to me, I guess. The best way to honor my fallen comrades is by training hard and growing even stronger. Then I'll crush Gerald's mercenaries and the Ashen Demon with them. That's what I'm going to live for now. Oh, but I like your spirit. Though I expected no less from my partner in destiny. I'm sorry, what? Yes, I suppose that was a bit sudden. I should remember, take intimacy in smaller steps. The point is that I'm here to guide you, and I promise to help you find the strength to see your dreams realized. Prologue. A chance encounter.
The continent of Fodlan, said to be protected by a goddess, has existed for uncountable ages. Now, three ruling powers control the land. To the south is a region held for more than a thousand years by the Adrestian Empire. To the north is the Holy Kingdom of Fargus, ruled by the royal family and its knights. And to the east, a league of nobles that bends no knee rules the Leicester Alliance. Though once consumed in war, these three powers now exist in relative harmony. Nestled between them is Garag Mach Monastery, seat of the Church of Saros, the land's widely practiced faith and a power that helps to maintain peace across the continent. Not far from the monastery, at the northern edge of the empire, is a small village called Ramire, and west of this place, stretches a forest where a lone mercenary awaits. Hey, wake up! Ugh, how many times must we do this? Get up already! Huh? That's weird. I could have sworn I heard someone calling me. It's still dark out, though. Hello? Yes, I was calling you. Many times, I might add. <sighs> Come on, I told you not to sneak up on me like that. As if I have a choice. Do you know how many times you would have died by now if not for me? I'll tell you. Twenty-two. The three times you left off a cliff to quote-unquote get tougher saved you. Those five mad attempts to dispatch a horde of monsters by yourself saved you. And tonight, despite my repeated warnings, you took the wrong path and ended up having to sleep on a bed of leaves in the middle of the woods. All right. This was all my fault, and I'm sorry. Strange. That's exactly what I wanted to hear, yet somehow I'm the one who feels bad now. I must remember this tactic. At any rate, we all make a few mistakes along the way. And by we, I mean you. And by a few, I mean far, far more than average. Now then, with that out of the way, would you like to know why I've roused you from your mud-caked slumber? <laughs> <laughs> 